What is up, Disc Golfers? Today on Iceberg TV, we have a clip of Paige Pierce from the Disc Golf Network. To me, this is a bit of a concerning clip, especially after she loses Worlds. She hasn't been doing very well this year, and it doesn't seem like she's handling it very well. She's starting to go with the I don't care mindset instead of, you know, the what do I need to do to play better mindset. And again, that's just my opinion. I don't know what she's going through mentally, physically, and the, the Disc Golf Pro Tour is the ultimate grind. You are nonstop playing. There's all this pressure for her to win titles. There's so much pressure for her to win her next world championship. She has the huge documentary that came out that they apparently were trying to get Netflix involved with. So it's not really a great time for things like this to be coming out about Paige, um, not only for her disc golf career, but also for you know, her financial career, because we don't want to see clips like this when they're trying to sell a documentary to Netflix, things like that. I, I don't know. I just don't think it sounds very great from my perspective. So I'm going to play the clip for you guys. Comment down below. I would love to hear your thoughts in the comment section. In short, what went wrong? What adjustments have you made? Uh, what are you looking at to do this week on the course? Um, you know, I kind of already talked about that just in like, I'm lacking the killer instinct right now. I, I just don't, and I don't care to get it back for some reason. Like I don't, I don't actually care that I got whatever place I got. Um, I just want to throw good shots. And when I don't, I'm upset, but I'm not, there's no more like of me punching my hand. There's no, and it feels good. It feels damn good to just be like, no. There's no stress in my life, and it's just so great. Um, I think the biggest stress is like when people are like, what's wrong, what's wrong? It's like, nothing's wrong, actually. Everything's great. Last week. And just because someone says everything's great doesn't always mean everything's great. And I hope Paige is able to find a way to get her mental game back. Get that, I mean, her signature disc is the Fierce. That is, I mean, that is her brand, being a fierce competitor, caring about winning, caring about locking down world titles. And it's just not great timing considering that pretty much everyone thinks Kristen is the best FPO player in the world right now. And this, in my opinion, doesn't look great, you know, as far as Paige Pierce right now. If this is how she's feeling, I think she should step away from disc golf, free fall in love with the game, go on vacation. Um, I watched a lot of her vlogs and stuff when they're like, they're in Hawaii and they're doing all this other cool stuff. They're in California. She seemed very happy during those periods of time. So again, I don't know Paige on a personal level, but I think it would be really good for her. Take a step back, skip a few tournaments, maybe just play USDGC for the chance of, you know, growing her legacy. Skip the rest of the events of the year, go on vacation, re-fall in love with disc golf. Um, that's my opinion, but I would love to hear your guys' opinion in the comment section down below, and I wish nothing but the best for Paige Pierce. I hope she's able to get her killer instinct back and give Krista Tatar a run for her money because that is, as a fan of the sport, that is what we all want to see. We have a really good situation for the FPO field right now. The FPO field doesn't always get the same respect as the MPO field. We have such a good cast of characters right now and such a good group of professional females in the sport that are touring. I want to see them all firing on all cylinders and that is going to be the best thing to help grow women's disc golf moving forward is having it exciting, having your prolific players out there playing well. Comment down below. You're watching Iceberg TV. Do not forget to subscribe. Go check out bergsbags.com to get the number one disc golf bag. You're watching Iceberg TV and take care.